It's wonderful to talk to you. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. Um, look, this film has so much heart and there is laughter, but there are emotional moments. How was this for you to, to play real people and to do it in a respectful way that didn't become a caricature? Uh, yes, uh, yeah. Uh, it's important to not be a parody of those people. Also, when you realize those people are armed and could probably tear uh, your fingers out of their sockets <laughs> with their wrestling <laughs> techniques, you know. Um, I, I wanted to be honest, of, and I knew who Ricky was as a person. I don't know him as a person, but I knew his motivation as a man, as a father, and I, I was trying to be that rather mm -hmm. than doing an impression of Ricky, you know. There are many sentences throughout the movie that are very inspiring. Um, how, how was it for you to go through the process of your character that is painful and vulnerable? Um, uh, it, it was a lot of fun to do that, to, to sort of, um, in a film that sort of on the face of it, you know, people will think is just about wrestling. It was quite fun to sort of play someone who um, fails and sort of has to go through a whole reinvention mm -hmm. of themselves and um, deal with d dealing with failure like that I think can sort of push people over the edge and mm -hmm. completely reduce them and they give up and I think it didn't do that to Zach um, but obviously you know you've got to go there to come back and that's what happened with him. And now he's unbelievably successful in a completely different way. So it was a lot of fun to do that. It's a lot of fun when you get given, as an actor, peaks and troughs like that. I have been talking to a lot of uh, the journalists here and the consensus is that the movie is surprising. You go expecting something and it becomes something completely different that affects you and makes you react to it in a very positive way. How do you do you know that when from the script? Is there any there any way to to foresee that? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I think as filmmakers, you make something. You you know, Stephen writes a script, and then we get employed, and we do our bit, and then people edit it, and there's a music score put on, and I think all those things are things that you can control. But then once it's out in the world, that that uncontrollable element, which mm -hmm. is audience's reaction is something that you have no idea what it's going to be you know mm -hmm. I'm kind of su not surprised because it was a great script and it was fun and we had fun and but you know, there's a lot of warmth t toward yeah. the film and I think personally I think the world is kind of shit right now so if this film's going to come along and people watch it and for 96 minutes feel thrilled and happy and then I think that's a pretty good thing you know I think people are surprised by the fact it's not it's light and it's fun and this young lady worked her ass off and succeeded. You know, I think it's a great message. It is. Thank you so much Sorry for your time. Sorry I talked so thank much you. then. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Wonderful to talk thank to you. Thank you. Cheers.